Hi, this is Ming from Huashan Hospital, the first author of this manuscript. Our research is focused on outbreak of KPC producing Klebsiella aerogens in a Chinese tertiary hospital. And this study aimed to evaluate the molecular characteristic and the prevalence of the clinical carbapenem resistant CRKA collected during an outbreak in a tertiary hospital in China. Antimicrobial susceptibility test using 17 antibiotics was performed on 14 CRK isolates. The strings was examined for the presence of beta lactamase genes by PCR, and the FX pump phenotype was determined by FX pump an inhibition test. Presence of the outer membrane porins was examined. Clonal relatedness among the isolates was investigated by PFGE. S1 nuclease, PFGE, and the plasmid incompatibility group analysis were performed. And the genetic environment of the KPC was analyzed. Epidemiology data was collected via a chat review. And according to the results, the 14 isolates were all resistant to the carbapenems. Five distinct PFG groups was observed, and all 14 isolates carried the KPC genes. And the S1 nuclease PFG results indicated that the size of the KPC carrying plasmids to range from the 20 KB to the 200 KB. And the 14 plasmids belong to the various compatibility groups. The most frequent genetic environment of KPC was TN1721. And the PFGE type A group, including 11 KPC producing clinical isolates, was responsible for the dissemination. And for conclusion, our findings suggest both transposons and the vertical transmission to contribute to the transformation of the KPC2 gene. And the results strongly suggested that strict implementation of infection control measures to avoid the spread or the clonal dissemination of carbapenem resistant strains, especially, KPC, especially CRKA in healthcare facilities, is necessary.